From the gun so that it unloops like that, yeah. Okay, the car has been all rinsed down. Uh, rinsed free of any debris. Look at that. The water is reflecting off of the uh, driveway. That looks pretty cool. Anyhow, we're gonna go on to the uh, foam cannon stage. Get this all nice and covered in foam. That should be fun. an electric power washer so it doesn't have like the highest psi that would make like true snow foam um and i have like a gp amazon snow foam cannon so um, it does the job though it coats the car in soap and that's really what you want as long as you evenly coat the surface of the car with soap that ensures that the surface is lubricated and you won't cause any scratches or marring when you go uh, onto the second stage, which is using the uh, Chanel microfiber uh, wash mitt. And uh, normally you're gonna wanna use a two bucket method if, you are, if you're being super careful, but we're being lazy right now. We're just single bucketing it. But it does have a grit guard in there, which is the thing that goes at the bottom of the bucket that separates the uh, dirt from the, from the water, so. These are huge. What size are these? 20s? Okay, so the car has been fully washed. Now we're gonna dry it in the garage so it's not in the sun. Uh, and while you dry, you can apply like a quick wax. Uh, you can find a lot of them that say dry or shine as you dry or wax while you dry. So uh, all this standing water, you're gonna spray it down with some quick detailer, dry it off and it should be good to go. All right, so we went ahead and uh, took care of all the major uh, standing water that was on the vehicle with a big drying towel and some quick detailer. You can just swipe uh, most of it, um, basically capturing the water with your drying towel. Don't worry if when you're doing that, you leave little water spots because you're gonna have to follow up with a smaller towel anyway, like how Ronnie's doing right now. Uh, you follow up at the end with a smaller towel. You can switch up to a different quick wax or you can use the same one you use to dry the vehicle. 
It's totally your preference. But what you do is you just follow up with a small towel, get all the little areas you might have missed, and then ensures you have the perfect shine. All right, guys, we're all done now. We're pretty tired, so we're just on the couch. Car came out perfect. It looks wonderful. <sighs> but I think that's it for today. You can follow Ronnie at, oh, let me show you, at Rocket Bunny Ron. And you can follow me at sam.cff. We'll catch you in the next video.